Hey Ralph, here is uh, the load bearing vest that I'm sending you. Actually, this is mine, but no, the one is identical I'm sending you. So you have these are my, uh, these are uh, um, mag pouches which work really well. I use them as, uh, um, I've got some five, actually, I've got some uh, bank line here, which is uh, about 150 test pound skinnier than um, which is right here is uh, 550 cord uh, this is 75 so 75 feet obviously is a, here's my little backup knife which is by the way very cool uh, it's, a, it's a Gerber but uh, it's a survival knife kind of thing you know it's a, you know all hollow out so you can attach it to a pole but uh, it comes very sharp uh, I, I sharpened it up again but uh, the uh, the um, what you call it is very flexible the back sheath you can kind of orient it the way you like um, so if you like it on your belt you know kind of like this or like that but I just keep it in there um, because it is my backup knife so oh, oh, sorry about that and this is my actually I put it in my pocket when uh, I go hiking so I've got you know multi-tool whistles a couple lighter striker torch which works very well. Um, stone, sharpening stone, and a backup lighter. Uh, P51, little mini crowbar from the uh, the army. These things are really pretty hip. I don't know if it has. There you go. It's a government issue. Um, very cool. Great for you know unlocking your gun stock and shit like that. But. Uh, a lot of molly on it, which is really cool. Is what we like about this system. Um, water, canteen, you know, and the stove that goes with it. And uh, so that's really pretty cool. And this is <coughs> actually this little pack, <coughs> excuse me, is off of a um, rifleman setup that the, uh, the U.S. Army rifle guys use. Um, I store, you know, a lot of my just day hiking supplies, some more bank line, fire starter. I've got a uh, poncho in here, army issue, which is really pretty, pretty freaking nice. It's a very stout product. This is a Transia um, little, you know, pocket you know, skillet kind of thing, but I, I store, if I get hungry, sorry about that. Uh, I've got a cliff bar in there with some protein and some soup and which is kind of empty right now because I, I actually ate some stuff on a hike the other day I was kind of hungry so I keep that kind of just in case but if you get stuck in the woods at least you've got something to nibble on oh and then I have um, gosh RV sauce I got some oatmeal in here and soup mashed potatoes these things are really hip I'm digging these uh, Kind of single serving um these things are really pretty fantastic I'm, I'm digging them so i got that got some steaks in here to uh, if i wanted to make like a little uh tp tarp thing got some um industrial strength three mil uh, garbage bags i use i can use for cutting them. there's some snares this actually saw is probably the best saw i've ever owned and i got this from home depot it's a gardening saw, and the teeth on the, this thing just goes right through all the stuff. Those camping saws out there, uh, I can't think of the name right now, but um, yeah, it's it, it freaking goes through stuff like a, it's very amazing, very compact. Um, and I got you know that's pretty much what I got: some snares and oh 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 oh. This I think you'll totally dig. This is uh, a Frontier. Um, hold on, I'm gonna put this on pause. This is a my new personal frontier um, filter, and I think it's the ultimate. Is what it's called. Uh, oh, Frontier Pro, very cool, cool, cool. Uh, processes up to 50 gallons, so you know I don't have to keep my big ass filter with me. Um, there's your, you know, your pinch, your valve to you know, take you suck in. This right now I have it connected. This is the connection for um, my backpack um, bladder right there. But you can take this off 
and then you just connect this thing. Ah, shit. Ah, damn it. Uh, you can connect this to your uh, hot water heater if, if you wanted to. It screws into that, and then it'll just you can do a drip pour. Um, you could do also. Um, there's a straw in there, so you just connect that to here, and you can um, just put the straw into the water and then you just suck from there. You can also do gravity fed, uh, so you can put a, um, you know, most Nalgene's and the platypuses. It actually works really well with platypus. Um, and anyway, so very, very cool little filter, $15 and uh, 50 gallons. So it's a nice little backup and you don't have to carry your big ass, um, you know, pump or anything like that. So um, really like it and I highly recommend you get one. And Here's just emergency stuff, first aid, uh, fire starter, and then I got my sewing, or uh, down in there I've got um, my emergency, and you can see that it's a cigar box right there, but it's metal, and it's, you know, I've got some lures, sinkers, um, bull bullion cube, it's just my emergency kit, um, you know, and then there's some emergency blankets and stuff like that, some DEET and some other stuff in here, signal error and all that shit, so. But um, yeah, gives you an idea. And then right here, uh, power bar, a couple power bars, some <laughs> Slim Jams, those are always good to have. Um, and then uh, some TP. <laughs> and then a uh, thing. This, all this setup right now, as it is, weighs um, 12 pounds. And with this on, the way it's set up, it doesn't feel more than like a pound or two. It's just because it hugs the body and I really, really like it. And uh, it's a great system, especially if you like going out in the woods. Uh, it's got everything. This is what you call, uh, I mean, this is like my possible's vest. Uh, I have it all. So, um, yeah. So, sent it into the mail, um, dropped it off today. So, you should get it probably, I don't know, gosh, I don't know, three, four, five days, however long it takes. I uh, bought a bunch of these. These are pretty cool. Um, I really don't, you know, um, I just use this on here just because I have it. But uh, anyway, so, all right, brother. Take care. Uh, enjoy the best. Peace. Say out of Kate.